Hello, hello, and welcome to the reading and writing lesson. Today, we will discuss another pattern of development. So, we are done with narration, description, definition, classification, and exemplification. And we are now at compare and contrast or comparison and contrast. We will still discuss cause and effect, problem solution, and the last one will be, will be persuasion. So, let's start with these set of pictures. So, can you spot the differences? What are they? Different or similar? Yeah, that's right. They are similar. So, the word is similar. How about this one? Of course, the opposite of similar is they're different. So, difference. The word, the word is difference. How about this one? Are you going to plan A or to plan B? This way, another way, or that way? So the, the word is choice. So what is compare and contrast? So a paragraph using comparison and contrast, way of development, shows similarities and differences between two or more people, places, things, or ideas. Here are some helper words to show similarities. Is similar to both also. To show differences, you can use words or phrases such as on the other hand, otherwise, but unlike. Similarities and comparison and contrast Organize ideas Organize ideas based on how event places people things and concept are similar to or different from one another so you can show the, the differences or the similarities by Separately or side by side if you're going to make use of separate comparison and contrast You need to describe first the first item to be followed by the second item side by side on the other hand is describing the two items at the same time here are the signal words that you can use in comparing we have also equally in the same way similarly as in similar similar fashion like and many others here are also words that signal contrasting or contrast although despite instead otherwise and yet and many others let us read an example of a paragraph using comparison and contrast although I raised Marcy and Obi from puppies they have completely diverse personalities Obi is a six-year-old male toy Pomeranian Whereas Marcy is a one-year-old female, Boston Terrier. Obis is small and soft, unlike Marcy, who has bristly hair and is much bigger. Marcy insists on sleeping on the bed under the cover every night. On the other hand, Obi will only sleep on the floor under the bed. Obi is tremendously loyal and uptight. However, Marcy is hyper and friendly to anyone she meets or sees. Around other dogs, Marcy cowers to the larger dog. Yet, Obis will always stand his ground, never giving up until he is colded. Given that they were both treated the same way all their life, it is hard to believe that they are so different in everything they do. So in this example, we used side-by-side -side way of comparison and contrast. Comparing and contrasting two different animals. This is another example of a paragraph using comparison and contrast. But in this kind of example, we are using the separate comparison. Your activity your writing activity, you should act as a film critic. 
you are to write the comparative review of two films of the same genre. Use the comparison and contrast pattern of text development in your review. Thank you for watching reading and writing lessons and if you haven't subscribed to this channel, please do subscribe. Bye!